Liam Kirk oh, is this truly is a good historic. One. The first British, talking about an English-born player, born and trained, yep. first ever, and he goes at pick 189 to the Yotes, a talented player. No novelty here. He seems to really have a gift for the game. Yeah, he's the first born and trained in England player to be invited to the Combine, and, and it wasn't just to to sell this kid or, or, uh, or Great Britain. It, it's because he's got some skill. Uh, playing for the Sheffield Steelers, it's in Britain's elite league. Hey, I'd like to go over there, play a little golf, play a little hockey. Anyway, that's another story right there. His father, Matthew, actually played uh, played cricket. And so uh, this, is a, this is a family that's got a, a, lot, of, uh, a lot of ability, and, and I'm looking forward to it. He's about 6'1", maybe 156 pounds. Ranked 65th in the international rankings at the very end of the day. So an unknown, but an interesting pick. And uh, why not go to the Arizona Coyotes? There's a lot of passionate hockey fans. There are. not in, in England. Oh, yeah. That league's forever. They're really passionate over there. But maybe this will be the start of some significant growth. I'd love to see one day an NHL team in London. That would be just incredible. Oh, I, can, I, I would love to. Oh, never mind. I was thinking of Ireland and Scotland in that area. And We're talking trip, London, yeah. Fanger. I know, but it's close by, yeah. and I can play a little golf, you know? Yeah, maybe. Not yet. Not yet. We've got another round to finish here. Okay, sorry. Not yet. <laughs> Kirk, Kirk is a player that a lot of the scouts are, have been raving about, talking about, you know, this young man, if he could get over to North yeah. America, if we could get him in a little higher competition, where is his ceiling? He's playing very well in a men's league as a teenager. And this is an unprecedented situation. It's great to see Liam Kirk. It'll be interesting to see how he does in training camps and how he does through the, the prospects camps uh, moving forward. But uh, I think it's fantastic. Me too. I think it's great. And we were, everybody was kind of waiting to see yeah. when is he going to go. I think everybody yeah. knew he was going to go. It's just when is he going to go. It's going to be fifth, sixth, or seventh. So good for him. And he is a very likable young man. For more on his journey to the National Hockey League, here's our colleague Stephen Nelson. When you think of England, things that come to mind are probably royal weddings, James Bond, or soccer. Excuse me, football. What you almost assuredly don't think of is hockey. In England, it's not, it's not the most popular sport, ice hockey, but you know, it's growing. England's own Liam Kirk was introduced to hockey at a young age, and he's been hooked ever since. My parents went to watch the, um, the Sheffield Steelers when I was just a baby, and my older brother, and he was there as well. So he, he decided he wanted to play hockey, and as you do with all the, all the siblings, I just kind of copied him, and he just went from there. Kirk eventually went on to play for those Sheffield Steelers in Britain's elite ice hockey league. There's Kirk moving in, takes the shot on, and he scores! The first of many, I'm sure, for Liam Kirk. The first few years I started playing hockey, I just kind of had the dream to play for the Sheffield Steelers. But as you get older, you kind of realize, you know, how, how big the hockey world is. Being from a non-traditional hockey market, Liam Kirk has heard all the one-liners before. A lot of my friends at school used to kind of throw jokes around saying that they just need a pair of skates and to turn up and they'd make the England team. So that was kind of the reoccurring joke. But Kirk's game is no joke. Kirk's one time! He looks to become the first UK born and trained player to get drafted as well as play in the NHL. It'd just be a massive honor. Obviously, every kid's dream is to play in the NHL, so just to kind of get, get to the NHL is obviously the, the main goal, and it, that'll be an honor in itself. But obviously, being from, a, from England, it's a little different, so it'd be really nice. And if Kirk is drafted and makes the NHL, he realizes the impact it'll have. I hope that uh, kind of gives you know a visual to, to kids you know in all non-traditional hockey countries, not just England. That you know, if you believe and you just put in the hard work and you're committed, that you can make it.